Hey guys, it's Kay Chris and we're continuing on with our Qatar Airways series and today we are going to talk about the group dynamics. So the group dynamics is actually still on the day two of the three-day hiring process of Qatar Airways. So after the first elimination or the first round, which I talked about my other video, my previous video, check it out. Um, you will be then, uh, if you survive that round, you will be then asked to do a group dynamics activity. What is a group dynamics activity? It is a way for Qatar Airways to recognize if you will be a good part of the team. And that's it. That's basically it. Expectations. Okay, for the longest time, they have been asking like 15 or 16 of you who are left during that first elimination round, they'll be asking you to do an activity, either prepare an itinerary or create something out of sticks. So it really depends on the recruiters and what they are feeling on that day. Sometimes they don't do group, sometimes they do partners. So you cannot really expect what is happening. But speaking from experience, having applied for Qatar Airways for eight times and being able to go through the whole process the last time that I applied, um, all I can say is most of the time they will ask for a group uh, setting or a group activity. I only tried one time that they asked to partner up and um, do something with a partner. So here are my tips for you. Number one, make sure that you follow instructions very strictly. When they say don't look at them during the activity, don't look at them at all. So many times I failed in this round because I can't help it. I, I always um, look at the other people in the room and I wasn't and it's coming out as I'm not really interested in the activity, I'm not present, I'm not there, my mind is somewhere else. So they eliminate me almost all the time during this round. So never, never, never unfollow the instructions. Just follow the instructions. And also instructions like you have two minutes to do this make sure that you do two minutes okay so that's it um, the next tip i have for you is to speak up okay some people when they speak too much they get eliminated but also when people don't speak at all they also get eliminated so speak up how do you speak up just speak up the right way so the right way to speak up during the um, group dynamics is wait for your turn of course and when your turn is up Acknowledge what the person before you has spoken about or whatever his idea is. For example, thank you Marie, that was a great idea. Or that's awesome Marie. Yeah, that is a really nice suggestion. Doing something like that before you say your piece. Uh, it gives out this um, impression that you acknowledge other people and you call them by their name. That is the reason why you have these um, <laughs> stickers with your name on in the registration process. So you make use of that. The next thing is give your, um, give your uh, suggestion or your contribution to the group. Give a solid one. And after you have given your suggestion, Pass on the mic to the other person. Like for example, that is a great suggestion, Marie. We should really take our guests to Cebu because it's a great place to be. And in addition to your great suggestion is that we also take them to Boracay. It's one of the best place to go in the Philippines. And uh, aside from the activities, you will never get bored. The beaches are amazing. And um, it is something that will never disappoint anybody who's ever been in Boracay. So that's my suggestion. How about you, Anna? What do you think? So you see, this is the flow of speaking up. You make sure that you take note of that and follow this through. You will, make, you will be able, I promise you, you will be able to make it through the, this round. You will be able to make it through the group dynamics round. 
okay just be spontaneous about it be friendly have the energy while you're doing it be happy while you're doing it and you are also following instructions when you're doing it there is no reason that they will not make you or invite you for the final interview <laughs> so if you guys find this video valuable to you the next best thing that you could do is download my book summary over at my website so just visit misscakeris.com there will be a free guide there it's a one pdf downloadable form entitled eight proven steps to get your dream job as a flight attendant it basically summarizes this book that i am holding on right now and it helps you prepare every aspect of your preparation for the flight attendant interview and yeah and that is free so no worries all you have to do is give your email and don't worry we will not be spamming your email it will just it will just be me sending you uh, the free downloadable form as well as uh, free hiring alerts in the Philippines if you're interested in my book as well you could check it out it's available on Amazon or in Shopee and in my website as well so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video um, I have few more coming up so I will see you guys on the next one see you again fly with you soon Mwah.